Hello and welcome back to my channel. I wanted to talk a little bit today about what I do as a screener and why I say the things that I say. So as a screener, when you come into the hospital that I work at, I am required to ask you several questions. I'm required to ask you if you had a fever, if you've had chills or any kinds of COVID-19 related symptoms, if you are waiting for test results for yourself, or if you are or have been around anyone known to have COVID. Now, depending on the responses that I get, I will then take your temperature um, and then I will fill a little tag out that stated um, with your destination that you are going. I am not allowed to let you go to the bathroom, to let you use the vending machines, to let you use the water fountain. Um, there are no walk-ins allowed including joggers. What I mean by walk-ins is if you just so happen to use the bathroom and so you say, oh, there's a hospital, I'll just stop here. And you pull in and you come in and say, hey, I just need to use the bathroom. That is a walk-in. And I will politely and kindly tell you, no, can't let you go to the bathroom. Um, and I'm going to show you the reasons why um, after we've had to do this um, of why I say, no, you cannot use the bathrooms, the ATMs, the vending machines. Um, no, you cannot come in and just get water. I'm going to show you why. So when you ask to come inside our hospital, um, for one, it is a long travel to get to anything like that. So that is why we tell you no, because it puts our patients at risk. So the reason why when you come in and say, I just want to get water, and I tell you no, this is why. This is what we've had to do in order so that you don't get water or think you can't get water. Here is our water fountain. As you can see, it is covered. You can't remove it and it's under lock and key. Um, so this is why you cannot use our water fountains. And this is why you cannot use our vending machines. We have had to empty the vending machines and put these nice notices on them because people don't understand that no means no. Now, if you come in and have to use the bathroom, but you are a patient, you are able to use the bathroom. Um, and only if you are a patient, you've been screened and you've been checked into the hospital as a patient. Um, if you have to pay a copay, um, we do have ATM, but it is only for employee and patient use. If you have to make a copay, um, that is, of course, again, after you've been screened and um, checked into the hospital in your um, predetermined area. Um, and we do have water and ice. Um, we are a hospital. We do have water and ice. Um, if you are a patient, we will bring you a cup of water with ice. Um, or we do have bottled water in the hospital as well. Um, but no, we are not allowed to let you go to the bathroom. We are not allowed to walk you in. Um, there are notifications all around on the outside of our hospital and the inside of our hospital letting you know. I am not allowed to let more than one person in, um, regardless of if they are a patient for the hospital already admitted or if they are coming in for surgery or another procedure. Um, I cannot let walkers or joggers in, like I've said before. COVID is here. COVID is not new. COVID has been here since February or March. This process is not new. We are trying to keep our patients and our employees safe. If you have to use the bathroom and you're a jogger, use the bathroom before you leave your home or use the bathroom while you are at your gym if your gym is open. So just be respectful of your coronavirus screeners in the places that are keeping your family members safe, um, in the places that you would want to go for care if something were to happen to you. You would want to be safe. So when we stop visitors and extra people at the door, we mean it. Oh, and another thing, there are absolutely no visitors for COVID positive patients. They can call you, you can video chat, anything like that, but we are not allowed to give them visitors. That's to keep you safe and to keep our patients safe from you bringing in outside germs into them.
but that's my video for today thanks for watching please be sure to like subscribe and hit that bell for more videos like this bye